Yo, what's going on, everybody? All right, we are back with more NHL 21. We're in the second round. Um, we are. If I can go down here. Right now, we're up two to three on the Oilers. It this has been a very tough series, but this is how the um. Cups are playing, a cup front, uh, playoffs are playing out so far. So Florida is advancing. Uh, looks like Columbus and the Capitals are going at it. They're up by one, and Dallas won. So it's like I'll be facing Dallas in the final if we win. This is an elimination game. So this is why I'm recording here. But this series has been tough. They have been a very irritating ass team. <laughs> we'll say that. Um, as a matter of fact, let me see what I can get in my salary for. I already got that other car. Mm. This can give you like little perks and stuff, but. Yeah, I don't really need any other stuff. I might just go ahead and cop this uh gem here. Just for the hell of it. Now we broke. I have no money. Alright, but we're gonna get right into it. They have been um quite the irritating ass team to uh, take out. I will say that. I um, think we might rock the orange. Let them rock their alternate jersey. I like that one. That one's dope. Yeah, they're just very fast. So, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> a very quick team. Hi, everybody. Welcome to Oil Country, Edmonton, Alberta. He's Ray Ferraro. I'm James So they've Wilson. won two games against us. Anaheim's in closer mode here as they go into tonight's game. You want to stay hungry. You know the other team's going to be desperate trying to stay alive. But you can end this right now. <sighs> Gibson is holding strong, but he uh we put in uh, the backup on one night, which I don't understand. Gibson has been like, I guess he needs a rest or something. I don't know, but we end up losing that game. The backup did not help us. But it's the usual suspects, Drysdale and uh. Look at look. Need I say more? Look how quick that shit was. They're so fast, man. He has been tearing us apart. Just look, look at him. It's ridiculous. And he has time to pick a spot. Top bins. Oh my God, man. Connor me Jesus. It's ridiculous. Got the game's first goal. That didn't take long. Nobody really sitting down yet. Now they're back on their feet. The bench explodes. <laughs> he can't do no wrong, man. <laughs> he can't do any wrong. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Into the attacking end. God damn. End. Here's a short pass to McDavid. You see what I'm saying? You see how easy they, they just pick you off the puck? Like defensive play. Anaheim's got it in their own zone. I don't know. Sends the pass over. Tries to the paint. Damn, he got over there fast. But he came out and challenged a good save. Jocelyn for the puck and he loses control. Right in the slot from point blank range. Damn. Misses a golden opportunity there. You don't get the puck. He scored in like uh He's got a capital on. You wonder if that'll come back. I couldn't even get the puck. I skated over the puck and had and got no control of the puck. It makes no sense. 
He scored in like 20 seconds. That was ridiculous. Which I think is hilarious because, like, they play like that on a game, but <laughs> in real life, that dude has to do almost everything uh, with, uh, what's his name, Dry Still? Dry Siddle? I, I can't never think of how to pronounce that guy's name. The other guy. Is it Leon, I think is his first name? I'll just say that. Come on, move. Look at how fast they are. See what I'm saying? Like, I had that corner completely. And they he just covered all that ground. I actually hate that we're matched up with their line. Their line is just, you know, if this was real hockey, we probably would not be playing their line. It will be a checking line or something against them or something. They are so damn fast. Look at, just look how fast they get to the puck. They are the only team I've seen that moves like that. That they get to it. Look at this. We had, we two people passed by the damn puck and nobody got it. But that guy, this one guy came up with it. I'm doing the best I can. But uh, I'll tell you. This is the worst damn team to get right here at this at this point. They ain't ass like they are in real life. Well, I ain't gonna say ass, but you know. Oh, come on, Raquel, you gotta bury that. The Oilers have it against the wall. But I, I can't get to the goal. I can't I can't get my openings like um against this team like I have with the uh the other ones. How did he get over there? Jeez. That's in a dangerous spot. He makes a good save here. Jesus, man. Hold up. Sorry about that. Let me... There we go. Anaheim's got the puck along the wall. I feel like I came in too loud right there. I feel like if we if we can having this much trouble with them, I'm so I'm very worried about those defensive teams like like Columbus. I I I had such hell playing them during the season, and I just don't want to go up against that team. Are you serious? Unbelievable. How did he get control? <laughs> Bruh. Boy. How did he get control of that? Unbelievable. McDavid's won the draw deep in the defensive zone. McDavid gonna win that shit every time. Against uh, Raquel. Takes control of the puck. Ah! Did you see him uh, stab my stick before I could uh, do a backhand? Just beautiful. I'm telling you, man, these dudes are these dudes are hell. They are no joke. McDavid's been relentless this playoff season. He's among the league leaders in points, no matter how they check him. The centerman glide into position. Which is hilarious. During the... Uh, now, this is how the playoff hockey has stepped up here. During the, the regular season, I was slaughtering it. At 127 some, some points, like it was ridiculous. In the playoffs? Look, I've scored more than anything. Because I had to be, I had to be the one to score. Nobody on my team is scoring or do is doing much of a uh, anything, but they they playing good defense. I will say that. 
God damn. Torres had an opportunity to do something different, but he overhandled the puck, and now he's lost it. They play a good defense, but, yeah, but I, I'm getting, I'm getting whapped out here. I'm, I mean, they are, they play tight defense against me. So, I mean, as far as getting those open passes like I was, it's not happening. Look how closed up I am um, on the, on some of these passes. Makes a move in front. Look how yeah, he Misses. missed it. God, dog, man. You see that? You see how they double teaming me? Like I can't, I can't do nothing. And it's been like that the whole playoff. I can't get any uh, I can't get any chances that uh, I had during the season. I was a whistle on what? In the final oh. moments of this period, the Oilers have taken a one nothing lead. This, like literally they'll win off that, that one that one nothing. Because we can't we just can't get we can't get in their zone, we can't move, we can't do much of anything. I've gotten um second period set to get up rebounds and um one was a deflection goal. Uh but it's been dirty goals. It's been it's been nothing that's like we put together. Slides it back to the blue line. Makes the It's been like like right there he'll miss that and I'll bang it in or something like that. All dirty goals. Hang on it. Uh, look at that. And he will win it as soon as I say he ain't going to win it. The Oilers get a hold of the puck along the boards. Come on man. You see how he blocked? You see how McDavid blocked me off? Go back and look at this that play when it when it started to break out. McDavid got right in front of me just to make sure I couldn't get the puck. They've been playing some beautiful ass defense against me. I I just will say that they they like we not gonna let him hurt us. They hit me. They done everything they could to hurt me. Look at that. See? Okay. <laughs> Before I can even get a shot off, a slap shot. He was like, nope. Let me get on the bench. I can't do shit, man. And, like, I really need the help of the team. And nobody's doing hardly anything. Troy Terry uh, is the only one on um on the, in the, uh, on the team that's really, like, stepping it up. Troy Terry has uh, scored, like, well, I think he scored like three goals, three or four goals this series. But he's like the only one. Did that dude just hit both of us and we flew off him? I can't get to the goal. It's a frustrating ass team, man. Takes a nice feed up through the middle. Unbelievable. Larson's lugging the puck. And now it's over to Yamamoto. Somebody go ahead and step up. Can't do it by myself. This Clef Boom or Clef Blom dude. Oh my god. He has just he has hit me so much during this series. They had a fight in the last game because he hit me. He's, he's just sticking me to the board. Like I said, it's just been a frustrating series. I'm sorry I complained so much. This series has been frustrating. Oh my god, dude. Come on, man. I didn't realize they had all these players, uh, tourists and stuff to play for them. Slides it up front. Takes it into the slot. Ah! Quick work. He 
That's one and two saves in a row. Big hit along Come on, we got to bury that, man. In perfect form here. He closes off the gap and runs them in. Anaheim's got it in their own Hell, I'm, I'm scared to play the rest of these teams if this team is this damn tough. They are hard, man. <laughs> they just faster. It's not the fact that they they like overly physical or anything. They're just so much faster. And it shows. That we can't get out of our zone fast enough. The Oilers gain control of the puck against the wall. I feel like they're faster than everybody on the team. The Ducks look to start the transition. Sure, you just play for the Ducks. Slides the puck across to Raquel. Gaining momentum along the wing. How did he do that? <laughs> Bro, how did he do that? I, I deked it away from him and he still and stuck his stick in there and got it out. Comes up with the steal. And that skips away on a nice defensive deflection. He grabs the puck here at the point. Let's go, 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 go. Shit. Here's a short pass to Henrique. Come on. God damn it. Got a hold of the puck. They go on the attack through center. Manages to hang on. Trying to get back on the attack now. This is ridiculous, man. Sends it ahead to McDavid. You can't get to the goal. The pass. Here he is in close. Oh, what a Look at that. Stick by get off me, dude. God damn. Look at that! He just snatched it out there! Oh my god! <laughs> Yo, we just don't we I feel I feel like they gonna win, man. I really do. Really, he can't. Every time we get in the zone, he can't win shit. We get a good chance. Quick feed to Raquel. Thank you for passing to me. I have no goddamn angle whatsoever. Here's a shot. Big time That's a bad shot? Okay. Here in the late goings of the period, the Oilers lead it one nothing. I mean, you literally can't do nothing but fire just at just fire stuff at the net. Passes over to Larson. Takes the feed. I feel like we're a step slow. I don't know what it is. Or maybe they just that damn fast. Give me, give me that puck. Give me that puck. Come on, man. Damn. I don't care. I'm going for it. Got him. Finally. Jesus. Henrique has been oh, he's been pretty decent. He's been good in the playoffs. But it's like him, my line, of course, and Terry. They've been like the they've been the main ones. That's at least doing something. Okay. I agree that was a critical goal because we can't get much of anything going. Big third period coming up for both teams, and we're ready to go. All right. The next goal will be a critical one as we are still yes, it will. What? What the hell? My goodness, bro. I like this move that the coach is going to get the youngster no, right back in score. the game. James, they've had the majority of the chances tonight. I don't think they need to change anything, and that's including getting this kid back on the ice. Keep on pushing. That's the message from the man between the benches, Ray Ferraro. Lots of time left in this period. And it's all, all right. tied up. McDavid's won the draw here in the offensive zone. No, don't let him get the angle. Oh, man. Uh, we used to laugh about this and say, oh, the Why do you always try that stupid ass deke, man? But I'm sure the 
trainer's going to check on him here as this hits him right in the face. He always does this, the, the, that, that deke and leaves the puck in the middle. Of the, I, I don't know why he keeps doing it. It's like, dude, you don't have enough, I don't know, skill at it or something. And he just can't do the shit. Yeah, I have not been the MVP of this series. Uh, this series has been Terry and uh, Henri uh, Henrique have been the main one scoring. I scored, I scored like three goals, four goals maybe, but I feel like they've been the bigger helpers than anything. Do something with it, man. Oh my god. The Ducks have it now. Oh come on, man. Anaheim's got the puck along the wall. Dry Sidles moving it ahead. Smart heads up, play oh, shit. intercept the pass. The Ducks move the puck in the defensive zone. Thank you. Let's get a change. The Oilers gain possession along the wall. Oh, we're not we're not doing enough on offense. Wow. I think I'll be there, though. To Neal. Sends a pass over. Handles the puck. Sends the pass over. Takes it in front. And he makes the save. Koskinen's gonna Shit. hang on for a whistle here in the third. Well, there's not much time left here as you get into the final 20 minutes. The game's close. A mistake now would be critical. Getting closer against to McDavid again, man. Frame. God. You can feel the energy <sighs> in this crowd. It's a tie game. And I hate this dude so much in this game. Zone. Went for the dirty dangle and it goes sideways. Takes it across the Look how tight he is on me. He's so fast, dude. <laughs> the the oh my and god, where's the defense? Where's the defense? Why would you do that? Why would you do that when I have two men next to me? I'm double teamed at all costs and he's gonna pass the puck to me. Just stupid. Feeds the puck up to Cassian. And he gains the zone here. Anaheim's got the puck along the boards. Fowler Cover that guy. Cover the guy in the slot. Are you serious? The, call. the Oilers are getting penalized for slashing. A little bit of frustration there. He's out of position and he gets... A hell, he slashed for a while. Oh, wow. Oh, he's trying to get the... Uh, the he's trying to lift his stick. Tonight. Doesn't matter whether you've had one or ten power plays. The fundamentals of it are the same. Win the draw, get the puck to the point, try and spread the penalty. This is a perfect up. chance. Long pass into the neutral zone. Damn, they play oh, way back. Slides it across, and he denied that opportunity. Shit. Koskinen's gonna cover. We got too far past him. Busy tonight, Ray. And been good. A lot of times you get busy and worn down. You damn sure has been good. On it, freeze it in a close game. And with the two tied up off the face-off, a great read to grab possession of the puck. Backhander, and that's blocked. Damn. Koskinen's got the puck. Boy, he's been under fire tonight. Been really sharp, and in a close game, you can't make a mistake that costs a critical goal. Come on. Here in the back half of this period, we are all tied up in this. They've won 21 face-offs. Face and he wins the draw. Just wide. He's pure Most trash. How Raquel has been in uh as a center. And they will not switch us. I, I don't I don't know what's going into it. I don't know what's happening. But that is just he has been so trash in the face off circle though. The whole series. That dude right there, number 77 for them, uh that Clef Blom, he is good, dude. 
Oh my God, how he is so good defensively. The penalty killers there to keep this game tied. They tie up the power play in pretty nice fashion. Look how he got that puck and just kept it free, kept him from him. Taking it from his own end. Are you serious right now? He took it all the way back into the zone. The Ducks gonna work on offense. Puck dumped in. It's crazy. Picked up along the boards by Henrique. Yeah, this is gonna go to overtime. And then they're gonna win it in 20 Puck seconds over in overtime because of uh McDavid. The Ducks played along the boards. Here he is. Boy. A lot on the line here in this offensive zone faceoff. <laughs> Man. Anaheim's won the draw, no go to work. Unbelievable. Moves the puck down low. The Ducks played along the wing. Here he is Whoa. on the back end. Got him. Go ahead goal, and we have a new game. Got him. All right, with five minutes to go, I'll take it. God, that was hard fault. It's a re—I bet it's a dirty goal. Look, you got a rebound. Yeah, it looked like it looked like Comtois threw it up. I just was trying to stick stuff it in there. See, look. Oh, it's a backhand. It looked like he rushed up against his pads. Well, hey, I don't care. Dirty goal. I'll take it. That's how you got to beat them. Like they, they're, they are that good. The rookie's had a really good game, and he gets a little tap from the coach as he comes back to the bench. That doesn't. All right, now we got to hold him off. Pretty satisfied when you know the boss is happy with you. We've called his name multiple times. He's been all over the ice tonight. All right. You already know Mick Jesus mode is going to be activated in Connor. The clock goes really slowly. You want it to run fast, and it's just me. Oh, give me the puck. Give me the puck. We get one more, we'd be all right. Damn. Here's a short pass to Nugent Hopkins. Maintains possession. Lugs the puck into the offensive zone corner. Scrum ensues along the boards. Edmonton's got a hold of it along the wall. Denies him again. Quick feed to Lindholm. I'm keeping this time going. We got to get out of here. They gain possession here inside the neutral zone. I can't get that angle. Passes right to the front. Ah. Come on. The Oilers will play it in their own end. Kind of lost control for a second there, but regains possession. You just got to keep it away from him. Nice entry from the right side. Yeah, but see, that that's all I've been able to do all series. I can get some goals, but my passes are not working. Oh, they tied it. Come on, man. And, of course, look who it was. He connects with the long bomb. Out front, right on the doorstep. Damn. Oh, I told you, that's this team, all series. That's all they've done. Everything I've done, they equaled it. I have no idea why it, when I make that pass, it always bumps, uh, hits my goalie. Here they are on the attack. Backhander in front. Gobbles the puck up there with the chest. I hate this team. I'm so serious. Critical draw here. The Oilers get a hold of the puck. Of course, New Jim Hopkins will win it. Moves it quickly over to Neal. Can't keep a hold Raquel has been god awful as a center. Look at that. Effort. He just took it from him. Into the offensive zone. The Ducks have it from their own end. Working the puck deep inside their own end. It's a two on one. Here he is in front. Puck yeah! Back the for the goal. yeah breaks this tie, James. Sorry if I scream in y'all ear. I apologize. Some all right. Oh, what an effort. He did everything he could to stop that. Beautiful. We got a rebound. Anyway. Dirty goal. I told you. That's the only way we can beat him. I thought I had that angle. I thought I had him. Yeah, about time Comtois did something. He's been he was great through the whole regular season, but when we got to the playoffs, he got on a scoring drought. I've been, I've been getting the ball, getting the uh, puck to him, and he's like slapping it wide. 
Nothing. He, that's only his second goal in the playoff. Oh, God, we actually beat him. Jesus. This team right here, bro. I just want to can I see Connor McDavid cry. One of them. Mission accomplished at one end of the ice and a long off season looming for the other. Off season Woo. starts now. You go through this handshake line. Well, we made it to the uh you try so Western far, Conference Finals. For Ray Ferraro, I'm James Sabolski. Thanks for joining us tonight. Man, that was tough. God. Oh my goodness. I don't want to see those guys again. <laughs> credit where credit is due. Those dudes are tough, man. Ugh. All right. Um, let's see who we have, uh, so nothing, which is advanced today until we get to the game. Okay. Yeah. I'll stop the simulation. All right. And here we are against the Dallas stars. When we come back. I'm going to end here. Yeah, that was a crazy-ass series. Yeah. <laughs> but uh, when we come back, uh, you will be seeing whatever elimination game is happening between me and the stars, I guess. Uh, thank you guys for rocking with me. Um, I really appreciate everybody that's checking this out. If you're new to my channel, please like and subscribe. It really helps out the channel. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next video. I'm sorry, I'm tired, man. That, that team right there wore me out. Peace, guys.